Hello guys, I am going to show you the Linux commands which I use frequently. In Linux, we use the command line interface that is the terminal rather than the GUI which we use in Windows. So let's begin. We are using our first command as cd. cd stands for change directory. So we are changing our directory to home. So you can write cd. In my case, I am changing to home. So the name of the directory is home. So I am writing cd space the name of the directory. So to come back to the previous directory, we write cd space dot dot. So we came back to the previous directory. Clear command is used to clear up the terminal. So, uh, so now we are using pwd. pwd stands for print working directory. So it is printed as slash. The slash stands for root. So we are in the root directory. Now we are going to another directory that is named Tushar. So I am listing the contents which is present in Tushar by typing ls. ls command is used to list the contents present in the directory. So there are many contents which are present in the directory such as desktop, download, music. That are the directories. So now we are going to desktop. Means we are listing a specific folder. So we are listing desktop. In desktop we have example of dot, dot text root dot desktop. So we are clearing up the terminal. Now we are typing ls minus l. Ls minus l will list also it will list the owner as well as the group of the directory. So in my case the owner of the desktop directory is Tushar and also the group of the desktop directory is Tushar. So in order to find the hidden files also, so we write the command ls minus la. So we can see that it also showed the hidden files. ls minus l it didn't show the hidden files. Sorry, I'm spelling it as minus. It's stack. So we clear up the terminal. Now my current directory is Tushar. Now I'm going to desktop. Now I'm going to copy the files which is already present that is example of text to I'm just copying it to home to share and downloads. Now I'm copying it to videos. So press enter. Now I have copied my example dot text to videos. Suppose I go to videos, now I am on desktop, suppose I am go to videos, I can see that example.txt is present there. I am listing the contents of the videos directory by typing ls, so we can see that example.txt is there. Now we clear up the terminal, always use the tab key to complete the command. Now the next command we are using is man, man stand for manual, suppose you are stuck in something you can use the man command, man stand for manual, so you can write man space name of the command, so I written man space pwd, it show all the things uh, which comes in pwd. Now the next command we are typing is uh, it is we are going to pwd which is uh, print working directory 
and we are going to desktop now we are going to move that example the text sorry we are going to remove write rm and name of the file to remove the uh, a certain file so you can see that the file is removed so we can clear up the terminal now we are creating a directory we can create a directory by using mkdir space name of the directory so we have created a example directory on desktop as we are on uh, desktop so in order to delete the directory we cannot use the remove command rm command so in this case we have to use uh, a recursion that is minus r tag r so we have used tag r to remove the directory so you can see that the directory is deleted clear up the terminal now we are using a editor that is text editor as we use notepad in windows we use nano in uh, linux nanox uh, nano is very simple editor so we are creating a file nano and uh, name of the file so uh, so i'm writing some uh, random text in the file so i'm writing this new thing so uh, if you want to save the file press control o and enter and to exit press control x so we are going to rename the file just just type mv that is move example dot text that is the name of the file to the new name of the file so you can see that we have uh, just rename the file so you can see by typing ls the contents of the desktop directory we are creating a folder that is directory name example now we are moving that example that dot text to example directory so the command is mv space name of the file and space name of the directory to where we have to move the file so we can now go to example directory and we can see that our ex.txt have moved to example directory clear up the terminal you can also use the vi text editor but i recommend to use nano text editor because it is very simple to use so now we are in desktop so we are going to create a file it is some random file we are writing something hello this is um, my file something we are writing you can write anything in this file i am just explaining press control o to save and press enter and press control x to exit now to view the contents of the file we can write cat cat command is used is used to view the contents of the file you can type cat and the name of the file so you can see that 
the text we have written in my file dot text less command is used to show the contents of the file but it it show in new terminal now we are going to example now we are using a grep command so we are typing less to open the output in the new window the name of the file grep command is used to show something text which is present in the file suppose i am writing m so it will show all the lines which have m a m so you can see that two files which have m it is in bold letter the am which is in bold letter always use the uh, arrow keys to change the commands the previous use commands so uh, i used arrow keys to go to the previous command now i am writing tag i tag i is used to ignore the case that is upper case or the lower case uh, to see we can we can edit it i am taking one upper case and the one lower case am i'm changing the second line am to upper case press control o and enter to save and control x to exit now you can see that it ignores the case linux is case sensitive do not try to misspell the words the case now we are using a echo command that is uh, print command now we are printing something text that is uh, a random text uh, and the uh, forward arrow the uh, right angular back uh, bra uh, that is the uh, that is used to output the something text that is we are going to print something text into a random file that is random dot txt txt we can uh, now list the example by typing ls now you can see that there is random dot text file and we, uh, we are going to uh, see the contents of that file so type cat random dot txt so you can see that we have printed something text now we are going to use touch command the touch command is used to create multiple files at a once so we are going to create three files touch file 1 uh, file 2 file 3 so you can see that uh, we have created three files f1.txt f2.txt f3.txt the terminal now change the directory now we are going to tusha directory now you are uh, using a command ch own to change the ownership of a file ch own then uh, we can specify the owner as well as the group of the file so you can see that uh, the owner of the file is Tushar and the group of the file is also Tushar of desktop so uh, the next command we are going to use is chmod to change the mod of a certain file so now clear up the terminal and uh, I am going to type ch 
एम ओ डी सी एच मॉड सी एच मॉड विल हेल्प यू टू मेक द फाइल रीडेबल राइटेबल और एग्जीक्यूटेबल प्लस डब्ल्यू इज फॉर राइटेबल सी एच मॉड स्पेस प्लस डब्ल्यू प्लस आर और प्लस एक्स स्पेस नेम ऑफ द फाइल लॉगिन एस रूट वी यूज सूडो टैक आई इट विल प्रॉम फॉर पासवर्ड राइट डाउन योर पासवर्ड एंड नाउ वी आर लॉग इन एस रूट सो दैट्स इट्स थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग डोंट फॉर गेट टू लाइक कमेंट and subscribe